<laughs> All right, so we're at the shop. The baby's crying. Tony's crying. Yes. Um, basically, we're preparing for Y2K while also getting some stuff together for the shop. And uh, we're gonna head, basically we're gonna pack up, get some display cases ready, and then we're heading to Atlanta on, I'll probably be leaving Thursday, Sam's leaving Friday. And then we've got the Y2K show on Saturday. And, uh, but basically we're gonna walk around, pick some games out that we wanna take with us to sell at the show. Um, it's a car show that's 80s, 90s, and 2000s cars. It's something that me and my buddy have wanted to do for a long time, and he made it happen. So we're gonna take over Atlanta Motorsports Park with lots of cool stuff. Um, but today, we're gonna walk around the shop and just try and find stuff that we think people would wanna buy. Tony, what are you doing? I'm, uh, I'm eating goldfish. What kind of goldfish? Mm. We've got the pretzel and extra cheddar combo pack. Do you think this is highly underrated? I think the pretzel ones are. Everybody loves the extra cheddar. Everybody should. If you were going to eat these while playing a video game, what video game would you be playing? Well, probably go back to what I'm playing, Need for Speed Hopper Suit on the 360. It's a good choice. Looks beautiful. You look beautiful. You're lying, but thank you. Tony? Yes. Tell us some more about this game that you've been playing. Well, they started me off with the Boxster Spider. Um, I wasn't too thrilled about that. Joe was happy about it. Uh, but I did beat a 350Z, so I'll take it. <clears throat> and I raced down the coast, 60 frames per second. Um, didn't drop any frames, and I was happy. It was, it's a smooth game. Ready, fancy boy? Okay, go. All right, so we picked out some games that we're gonna take to Y2K. Um, Tony kind of helped me go through some stuff. Uh, Tony, you want to grab another bin real quick? Yeah. I think there's one on the rolling table, actually. Um, but we've got a variety of consoles that we're taking that Tony packed up yesterday. And why are you showing that stuff? Show this stuff over here. Quit trying to shoot B-roll while you're shooting primary. Sound like a YouTuber. Um, basically, we're bringing in SNES. Uh, we got a GameCube over there, we got Dreamcast, Sega Genesis, corresponding cords. So I'm going to touch the styrofoam even though I don't want to. Of our sweet Y2K uh, spray paint stencil for the potato sack race, thanks to Emerald Inkwell Designs, Nate and Kenna. But we got a GameCube, classic indigo color. Uh, we're going to bring a couple of DMGs, Game Boys, and a PS2. Uh, so, so we try to grab a variety of games for each console. Uh, Sam, if you come over here, this is what we got on PS1. Got some like Gran Turismo's. A lot of them are upside down. Just do this all at once. Wait, this side's right side up then. So, Gran Turismo, some Spyros, Final Fantasy, Metal Gear. You know, basically your standard stuff that you'd want for your PlayStation if you were just buying a console and you wanted some games to go with it. Um, kind of did the same thing for PS2. Once again, just your standard stuff. Uh, since it is a car show, we're gonna bring some car-based games, some automotive games. Um, so yeah, stuff like that. Uh, and just general nerdiness. And then as Tony's putting all of this in the box. I was supposed to, I didn't know I was supposed to pack it up, but I packed it up. We got it. <laughs> <laughs> some games, uh, you know, Top Gun, Final Fantasy, some Genesis stuff. We've got some Dreamcast stuff as well. Oh, the Dreamcast stuff. A whole bunch of NES stuff, because everybody likes NES. Whether it be... <laughs> just take the call. Mario, Top Gun, yep. Top Gun, Turtles. I might grab some more copies of Turtles. Um, it just sold. Let's see. Yes. Got some of these sweet pixel frames. Yep. That we get in. So these are just like shadow boxes of video game scenes. Uh, we've got an assortment of them from Sonic to Mega Man. I think there's some Castlevania stuff in there. So we're gonna bring all that. Um, got some Famicom games, um, as well as Nintendo Power. I might grab a couple more Nintendo Powers off the rack. But we're trying to appeal a little bit to everybody. And what's going to happen is we're going to have our booth set up. Uh, we're going to take two LCD TVs with us, um, some HDMI adapters if we got them. Um, we might not need them. They, do those TVs have AV hookups? Yes. Okay, cool. 
Um, Are you bringing Fester's quest? Yeah, I'm bringing Fester's quest. Ugh. You look like Fester. Ugh. Um, so we're gonna have a couple tables set up under our tent. Have some TVs set up so people can play some games. And just bring an assortment of stuff. We've got these two display cases over here. So this is what we used to do when we'd work at conventions and sell stuff at conventions. We'd load stuff up in these guys, some of our higher end stuff, and then we'd make displays, um, you know, just to make it look nice. But basically, since this car show is going to be pretty rad, um, it's kind of like a throwback to the Nopey days and Hot Import Nights and stuff like that. We want to kind of hit that nostalgia factor for everyone and just bring some games that everybody remembers. We don't really know how this is going to go as far as vending goes, but I know that I'm going to have some fun because it's all cars that I love from the 80s, 90s, and 2000s. And uh, Sam's going to have fun because she's going to work and, you know, put wristbands on people. Tony's going to have fun because he's going to have the whole shop to himself with nothing to sell. So yeah. he gets to sit here and play Soul Calibur all day. Um, I was going to come. Molly's driving back from Iowa or whatever potato land she's from and uh, help us out. And uh, we're gonna shoot some more footage there too, so that'll be the next vlog thing. This one's gonna be kind of short. I'm just trying to hack some stuff together. Really testing out our new camera equipment. Um, there's more streams coming up, more vlogging, more stuff. YouTube things, you know? Um, when we get back from Y2K, we're gonna come over here and for those of you that had been to the shop in the early days, like the first year or so, we had this all like cleaned up and people could play games and stuff. Um, since we've got the warehouse, we're still sorting through things and taking them over there, like all these broken consoles that need repair. Um, and once we get that cleaned up, we're gonna set some more games up over here so we can run a couple consoles during the day. That way, if you wanna like check out a game, it's re really easy to pop one in or you know, if Tony wants to set up a thing like Monkey Ball Mondays and just run various copies of Monkey Ball across the board on different things. I'm not too good for that, but we'll do it. We know, we know. Um, and then over here, we've got Outrun, which maybe we'll plug this in one day and we'll just stream myself playing Outrun to some like synthwave. Um, I don't know. No, I just I don't even know what I'm talking about anymore. Hopefully none of you ever have to move one. Yeah, hopefully you never have to move one of these. Uh, I had Tony dismantle it in the back of my truck in the heat of summer. Um, what else do we have going on? Oh, we uh, ordered a new pinball machine today. Our first major pinball purchase. Yeah, it's focusing um, on Captain Skyhawk. Oh no! Here, we'll walk over here. Um, still trying to nail the focusing system down on this camera, but whatever. Um, we picked up Stern announced this morning the Mandalorian pinball, and as soon as I saw that Grogu moves and like uses the Force to like steal your balls with magnets, uh, I was sold. So we ordered that. That'll be here in June. That's exciting. It's very exciting. Um, had a party at the bar last night. It went really, really, really well. A lot of people playing Killer Queen. Monday nights are league nights. It's another cool thing. Um, this past weekend, we picked up another edition of the bar that we haven't formally announced yet, but you guys have already seen the pictures. It's Quick and Crash. It's a shooting gallery game by Namco. I want to say it came out in 99 or 2000, somewhere in there. Um, it's really cool, though. It uses like optical illusions and stuff like that. So we'll probably do a little video of working on that and getting that running because that's really interesting. But yeah, uh, we're gonna start filming more shop stuff just cause we need to and I miss it. And I love the shop. I don't love Tony, but I love the shop. Tony, I don't love you anymore. But I just got more NES games. That, I can't deny that. Um, yeah, in the comments below, if you were to walk up to a random booth of video games, what is a game you would want to see there to purchase? Not just for like a flip or whatever, but to play. If you saw like Top Gun or whatever, you'd be like, oh, I need that. That'd be cool, I think. Maybe. Nobody needs Top Gun. Tony, what's a. G Come over here. Come here. <laughs> Don't mind the baby. You were lacking Ram Racer, by the way. And second oh, yeah. Top Gun. And Mario Bros. If you were to walk up to this stack of games <laughs> displayed at a booth, right? 
very cleanly and efficiently like this. Cleanly and efficiently, <laughs> random lens cap. Yeah. Legitimately, if you saw these, you, Tony, what would Tony buy? Me, in particular, do I have, a, do I have like a number limit? Like, how many can I pick? You pick one. Get him shredded. Heavy shredding? Yeah. Have you played heavy shredding? No, I've always wanted to. You buy it based on the label alone. Buy the label alone. I tell you, you, you are game. making a Time Lord style decision right now. I have a feeling, but the label's so pink and like cool looking, like it's so rad. Yeah. Shameless plug. Um. Okay, that's fair. Not a Top Gun game, I'll tell you that much. That's crazy. I mean, I, I never played heavy shredding. I know like there's some good ones in here, except that. I think if this was like pre my collecting days and I was going to pick one probably be I mean Mario 3 is always like a good one but I think I'd pass over that and I would probably get Turtles Turtles yeah yeah just because that's a classic I don't know Sam what do you think Sam's manning the camera right now yeah I mean Skater dies pretty I'd good pick Mario Skater 3 dies. yeah I'm easy <laughs> Um, <laughs> that's all I got. I don't know. We're going to Y2K. <laughs> We're stressed out. We're trying to pack all these boxes. Hopefully the event goes well. I think it will. There's like a gas shortage or something right now. I think it's an artificial one. I don't really know. Um, but I think I'm driving up tomorrow and Sam's going. To, wait, tomorrow's Wednesday, isn't it? Yeah. Whew, okay, cool. <laughs> I'm driving up on Thursday. Sam's driving up on Friday. And then the show's on Saturday. Then hopefully we can eat some food on Sunday. Because we're not allowed to eat between now and then. Why? <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, that's brutal. Um, oh, Karate Champ was down here too. Oh, uh, Karate Champ's a good one. Yeah. yeah, new games at the bar. The bar has a bunch of new beer coming in this week. Shop is rad. There's new games every day. We got, actually, this is the most GameCubes we've had in months. Yeah. I All seen, two of them. I haven't seen this many GameCubes in a long time. And controllers. Um, we've actually got a lot of good games in right now. But. We do alright sometimes. We're going to start posting some more videos again. Trying to get more regular with the vlogging now that I have a new video set up. Um, not going to lie, before it was kind of a pain. But now things should be a little smoother. Um, now the lens cap is off. You know, the lens cap is off. Um, that's backwards. That's upside down. <laughs> it's a Sigma. <laughs> but normal YouTuber stuff, like, subscribe, comment below. Do you have anything to add? Buy stuff. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I like candied jalapenos. Those were good. I don't know where they are. <laughs> I yeah, lost. Did you not take them home? No, I lost them. They were in the fridge. How did you lose okay, them? They were I the lost fridge. a jar of candied jalapenos. They're incredible. I put them on burgers. I brought them for people to try. It was the last jar I could find, like in the panhandle. How and I lost lose? them. I don't know. <laughs> They're going to turn up somewhere and stink up the place. You already do that. <laughs> I mean, somebody did that with their uh, bottle. That. Their. Uh, dip. Dip gross. bottles. Yeah. Disrespect. Disrespect. One of the places you'll go. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, follow the channel. Uh, there's going to be more videos like this, hopefully. I'm trying to get better at this. I know that, like, we did really well, dropped the ball, did really well, dropped the ball, did really well, dropped the ball for five years. Yeah. Uh, streams are coming back strong. Got a new streaming setup going as well. So this should be good. Right? I don't know. What do you guys think? Fingers crossed. I'm excited. Fingers crossed. No faith. No faith. <laughs> um, but yeah, hopefully you guys have a good weekend. Pay attention to Y2K this weekend. It should be a good time. We've got a ton of cars signed up, a ton of people coming. Um, a lot of cool cars, too. We had a... What is... It's like a Cadillac Broham or Oldsmobile Broham, oh, oh, um, but a Brom. diesel. That's weird. Yeah, that's what I said. Yeah. What? Um, got a lot of JDM cars coming. Factory? Um, I think so. That's I don't know. Really weird. I'm glad you're as confused as I was. That yeah, was like no, the same face I made. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> so that should be fun. 
Shops open this weekend. Bars open this weekend. Uh, we've got a new food truck coming outside the bar. This weekend called Cheezus. It's a grilled cheese place. There's a party. They specifically requested them. So they look pretty rad. We're going to hunt them down tomorrow and eat a spaghetti sandwich. I was going to say spaghetti sandwich time. <laughs> well, maybe we'll get spaghetti <laughs> sandwiches for all three of us and we'll just eat them on camera. Like the time we just ate wings on camera while doing a uh, fantasy draft. Yeah. yeah. That, that was really appealing to everybody. I'm sure it was. <laughs> um, it's the rad junk only fans. YouTube loves to watch us eat. <sighs> It's gonna be us eating spaghetti sandwiches. Yeah, that sounds really good. I'm hungry. Let's go eat. Yeah, it's time for food. <laughs> yeah, cut it. <laughs>